What is going on, guys? Santana with a brand new walkthrough. Today we are doing Hogwarts Legacy. That's right. Something new to the channel. Walkthroughs are being implemented. So grab your popcorn and let's get right into it. So we're going to just go through the character creation real quick and then we're going to just dive right on in. Hope y'all are ready because I am. Like I said, I have walkthroughs coming. I'm going to be bringing a lot more walkthroughs. Still doing Tony Hawk. Just needing to get it all out there for you guys. Watch. Um, I got another game we we'll playing. I don't want to spoil it out. Yeah, you'll see it when the first video for it drops. Um, big things. Big, big things coming to the channel. And you'll see here, I am playing on hard. Playing on hard. I know. I'm crazy. But, if I'm going to do these walkthroughs, I'm going to do them right. So, hard difficulty for everything. It appears we are almost ready to depart. It's a pity we didn't have a bit more time to spend on spell casting. I presume you've been practicing the spells we worked on. I have, Professor. Well, I'm quite sure I've never seen anyone take so quickly to a second-hand wand. You'll be a force to be reckoned with when you get your own. Thank you, Professor Fig. I appreciate you working with me all the time. Oh! <laughs> Eleazar! George, glad my rather cryptic description of our location did not thwart your finding us. I've apparated to more vaguely defined destinations than this. <laughs> Though I confess I may have miscalculated slightly on my first try. <laughs> Gave quite the fright to some fittergoers in the West End. <laughs> it's been much too long. When I received your owl, I must uh, say I... Best not speak here, Eleazar. Mm -hmm. Of course. Why don't we speak en route to Hogwarts? We have a start of term feast and a sorting ceremony to get to. Wonderful idea! As long as your young charge here doesn't mind me tagging along. Not at all, sir. After you. Ages since I've been to the castle. Would be good to see the old pile of rocks. excited for this so I actually bought the game wait a minute who was that anywho I bought the game a while ago my wife I think I've never played it and I started start doing YouTube so here we are I'm glad I waited on this because I don't know anything that's gonna happen I didn't watch any YouTube videos I haven't already played ahead it's all gonna be brand new to me and maybe even brand new to some of you. I know this game was pretty popular at a, at a, about a year ago when it released. So a lot of people have probably already seen the whole thing, the whole shebang. But if you've already seen it, don't spoil anything for me. But just embark on the journey. <laughs> just barely. <laughs> and who is your traveling companion? A new student. New? Yes, sir. I'm starting school as a fifth year. How extraordinary. It is indeed. None of the faculty has ever heard of anyone being admitted to Hogwarts so late. Nor have I. Of course, as the other fifth years will have been honing their magical skills for four years now, the headmaster asked if I could get our new student up to speed a bit before the term begins. Well, you couldn't have asked for a better mentor. Professor Fig is not only an exceptional teacher, he's also a remarkably intuitive and gifted wizard. Mr. Osric is prone to flattery. I dare say it's one of the reasons he's risen so far at the Ministry. <laughs> Brown noser. Have you seen this? I have. Opinions differ as to how great a threat Ranrock really is. 
Although I've yet to convince my colleagues at the Ministry, I believe he is a significant threat. And it was your wife, Eleazar, who alerted me to his activities months ago. Miriam? How? <sighs> she wrote to me about Ranrock before she died, wondering what the Ministry knew about his activities. Before I could respond, I received this. It was the last thing she sent me, Eleazar. It came to me via her owl, but with no correspondence. I can only assume that she had to get rid of it quickly to keep it safe. Presumably from Ranrock. I cannot open it. Whatever magic protects this is powerful indeed. It looks like goblin metal. That symbol. What's that glow? I don't see a glow. Nor do I. Is Buddy tripping? Oh, wait, I see it now. Merlin's beard. How did you wait? We did. Oh! Oh, no! Lord Jesus, I don't want to die. That's a whole dragon. Oh. Oh. Buddy. Yeah, man. Ride the ca Oh. Oh, man. Like, feel like I know we're not going to die because obviously there has to be a game to be played, but good lord. How do we get out of this? Well then. Not all you right, hurt. man. Perhaps a bit. Take this. It's Wigan World Potion. That stuff will write you in a second. Down the hill. Okay. I guess let's get started. What happened? Poor George. I can't believe he. Did this man really ask what, what happened? Who got into that damn thing? Attacking a carriage midair? A typical dragon would never. Professor? <sighs> Sir, where are we? I'm not sure. But that key you discovered was clearly a port key. Port key? An item enchanted to bring whoever touches it to a specific place. I'm feeling better, sir, if you'd like to look around a bit. I would. But stay close. We've no idea who created this port key. Believe me, I'm going to stay as close to you as I can. I don't know what's going on. You want to look around, but I'm not. I'm sticking by your hip, my brother, okay? Oh, snap. This game. Looks glorious. Oh, oh, oh my. And the carriage traveled. We're somewhere in the Scottish Highlands. So, those ruins. Do you the port key was meant to lead us there? I do. This has not been the day either of us expected. But Miriam sent that port key to George for a reason. And I believe that she, and now George, died in pursuit of whatever it was meant to lead to. If you're sure you're all right and wouldn't mind indulging me, I'd like to have a look around. Absolutely, sir. Good. Let's see if we can find a path, however faded it may be. My man's almost down with some adventure. Boy, he ain't out your mind. Whatever. A good question. It's best believe I'm gonna stay fine. I'm not letting him out of my sight. I need help. Form of ancient magic. Ancient magic. Yes, 
a powerful magic wielded by a rare few that seems to have been lost to time. Hogwarts Castle was built by and is itself a stronghold of that ancient magic. I don't know where she came into possession of the port key, but I am certain it was to do with that search. Ah, there's the path down below. This way. Man's just talking about ancient magic port keys, and I'm just looking at the scenery. <laughs> it looks so good, so, I can't help it. Why was your wife searching for evidence of lost magic? Miriam wanted to understand why such powerful magic disappeared from the wizarding world. Spoke of the good it could do. But magic is no different than any power. What really matters is the one who wields it. Is that ice? It's not cold enough here. It appears to be a sort of enchantment. Someone wanted to block this path. Let's see some of that wand work you were practicing. Focus on the center. Oh, yeah, we're gonna probably start actually pressing buttons around here. Let's go. Excellent! <laughs> Shoot, I know. <laughs> that was a I move in excellence, my boy. Now, I don't plan to, like, like try to collect everything, but there's a few times I'm going to see if I can mess with something. Ah, up there. We're close now. It's just ahead. Yourself. Oh snap, look at this man. I'm glad he's teaching me because that man said Rapero and built a bridge. Almost Is he there. like an old British Jesus who can walk on water too? I might need to find out. <laughs> Why would someone have built this here? I suspect they valued their privacy. That poor key led us here for a reason. Let's have a look around for anything that seems out of place. Man, everything seems out of place, especially us two. Professor, this statue... This may have been his home! <sighs> that enchanted crystallized stone again. But what could it be blocking? What's this? Professor Fig! someone have conjured that enchanted stone here and how is there a room behind it what room I don't see anything there's that glow again like the glow on the pork key container my dude just boss me he's seeing things even this dude can't see crazy what in Merlin's name Godric's heart where are we? I don't believe it. Hello? Oh boy, we gotta wake up. Tell us where we are. We need to figure some stuff out. This man snoring happy. <clears throat> Jealous.
Boy, speak up. <coughs> oh my god. I'm gonna almost fell off his off his stool. It can't be. Uh, just a moment. <laughs> Ooh. Oh my god. Welcome to Gringotts Wizarding Bank. Vault number 12, I presume. <laughs> Precisely. The key? Mm hmm? Your wife's port key. Oh, yes, of course. This way, then. Stay close. It's to a bank. I don't want to talk too much to this pet scenes, guys. Especially in case some of y'all are new to watching, new to this uh, game. Don't mind if I do. This is some kind of bank. inside the cars. If you don't wish to lose them. <laughs> <laughs> Man, just where do I need to go? This big old bank. How many volts are there? Hundreds. In fact, you'll see quite a few on our way to vault number 12. As we speak, we're just beneath the main lobby. The vaults you see now are the newest. Are private entrances to the bank common at Gringotts? They are most uncommon. Only one with great wealth or power, or both, could have arranged for such a service. You want to take a breath? A what? That waterfall washes away all enchantments. It's a security measure. Experienced the thief's downfall before, have you? Heard of it? These are the lower vaults that we're passing now. How deep are we going? Vault number 12 was commissioned shortly after Gringotts was founded over four centuries ago. It resides in the deepest part of the bank. Settle in. We've quite a distance to go. Love me a good car ride. Jesus Christ. Hold! <laughs> They got his hand out. Vault number. Vault 12. Momentous day. <laughs> hmm. On your way. You man seems grumpy. wondering about that goblin back there. He watches over the oldest section of the bank. Rare anyone goes there anymore. Da -da -da. <laughs> you have arrived. the last time this vault was accessed a goblin has been stationed at my desk for hundreds of years in that time no one has visited vault 12 until today imagine dudes he just touch the ground if he really just kind of bends his knees like to a quarter degree vault 12. thank you for your help He's like a mini Victor Wimbenyamba. <laughs> Any basketball fans out there? What do you suppose we should be looking for? I'm not sure. Sir, I wonder if you might... The instructions for Vault 12 indicate that I am to grant access to the holder of the key and then close the door. Wait. Yo, what? Best of luck. 
<laughs> Professor, that was certainly unexpected. Let me think. There must be something here. Hmm, Revelio, perhaps. Revelio? Yes, a revealing charm. No time like the present. Let's see what we're missing, shall we? Ready your wand and focus. Alright, simple enough, simple enough. Although this man got me on this grand adventure, I'm supposed to be in school. Getting my, getting, figuring out what I'm supposed to be. A door. Well, that's a start. There's that symbol again. I don't suppose you see a way to... I do, Professor. That symbol has the same glow as the one I saw on the port key container. If what you can see reveals the way forward, then I dare say we are about to discover the secret of this vault. Lead the way. You're gonna have the kid lead the way? Lumos! This is no ordinary vault. I suspect we will need to earn our way out of here. What do you mean, earn our way out? Do you think this is some sort of test? I do. But to what end, I can't say. Stay close. There will be no disapparating if things go poorly. Rebellion. Not out of Gringotts. And do not let me get tutorialized on here. I know there's going to be some sort of fighting around here. There's got to be. Make you spring into action at the beginning of the series. I see something up ahead. What is it? That glow again, but on the floor. Lumos! What happened? When I moved towards the glow, it suddenly seemed as if the ground was swirling about. Are you all right? Yes, sir. I'm fine. You seem to have caused the floor to change. That statue? What statue? I see some sort of statue, but only as a reflection in the floor. Revelio. I presume this is what you saw reflected in the floor. It is. The reflection's still there, but the statue's positions don't match. Wait. When you moved, the reflection turned in the direction of the light. Hmm. Perhaps you should cast Lumos. And Jesus said, let there be light. Which means I am Black Jesus. Okay. Oh. Well done. Now the reflection is turning towards me. Uh, homeboy, why are you moving? Uh. Look out! Boy, don't try me. Oh, snap. Hey, that was hey. That man, that man on it. I'm not here doing nothing, bro. They gonna carry me to victory. Look at this. I don't have to achieve. Oh, look at that. I am achieving greatness, even though I don't have to. Well, so Man. I'm gonna I'm gonna have to already use potions, man. It's just this is just the beginning. I need to use a 
Ecco. I'm not trying to see it in the one comment I'll get in this video. Oh, you trash, my boy. Hey, man. Back off. I'm playing on hard. I ain't played this game. I ain't played a single player game in probably a good 10 years. Let it slide this one time, okay? Professor! Professor Fig! Professor, where are you? This isn't good. Well, where am I supposed to go? Well, I've been lost my uh, lifeline over here. The wisps of magic seem to be leading me somewhere. Rebellion. Lumos. I was gonna cut this part out, but it don't take long because Rebellion. Lumos. I can I only really go so far away from the objective here. Revelio. Lumos. Ah, that's where they're leading me. That glow again. Well. Revelio. No. No. Oh, I don't want to be on my own, <laughs> Professor Big. Please. It seems I have no choice. I'm going to have to fight my way out of here. Yeah, 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 get got me. Ow. You don't keep trying me. Yeah, keep trying me. Okay. Okay, let's go. Making the ground shake out the big hooves. Ow. I need to change my aiming system because see, I'm hitting the person I'm not I'm not uh deflecting. I mean I guess it don't really matter too much because you ow, either way I either way I stun whoever I hit. Ow. I'm in the red again. And I'm not a potion, so... Oh, God. Y'all don't see it, but there's definitely some internal panic going on right here. And I'm an A-game now. I'm not an A-game kind of person. When it comes to these kind of games. Let's uh go back to finding Professor Fig, please. That man was co-witted. That man said, Ozzy, love you also, and started just destroying stuff, man. Revelio. All I can do is reveal stuff and light stuff up. Lumos. Rebellion. Lumos. Alright, let's just go ahead and follow the light trail. Rebellion. Look at me, I'm hungry for some chests, man. Lumos. I don't even know if I'm gonna really be getting anything useful out of them, but I'm still wanting them. What in the world? Ah, a pathway. Man already good. Look at me, I'm so quotation marks powerful because <laughs> I can see this extra stuff. Hmm. 
And he just walks on in like I own the place. I still have no idea where Pastor Fig went. Oh! Uh, there you are. How did you... What is this place? I don't know. But I found this floating above that basin. That is no mere basin. That is a pensive for viewing memories. I wonder... And I wonder... Follow my lead. Ooh. Let's go on in then. Tell this dude's cold with it. He's just flicking it, not saying nothing. Just got all kinds of stuff populating. All is in place. The portkey is well hidden. Perhaps too well. I wonder if the path we've created may be impossible to follow. It will only be impossible for one who cannot see traces of ancient magic as I can. Your ability to see what others cannot will not be enough, Percival. We are entrusting the one who embarks on this path with powerful secrets, with knowledge others will do anything to obtain. Yes, and if we are correct, Charles, the witch or wizard who completes the trials will have proven themselves worthy of that knowledge and the responsibility that accompanies it. We've done all that we can. I mean, I've been given this great responsibility, task, and power without asking for it. That's what you're seeing. The glow that surrounded them. Yes, sir. Astonishing. Can I see magic? Traces of an ancient magic, to be precise. The magic that Miriam had always believed existed but could never. Miriam, and perhaps George, died in pursuit of knowledge that has been dormant for centuries. And you, it seems, are the key to understanding why. We were- It all looks rather different than it did a moment ago. <laughs> Someone's coming. Great. Who were they? I don't know. But, sir, you shouldn't be in there. I was right. Oh, well, that's the little dude from the magazine. Seems my reputation precedes me. I was beginning to think no one was ever going to visit Rackham's vault. And why are you here? No need for that. Just give me whatever it is you found here and we can let bygones be bygones. Sir, they have the key to the vault. <laughs> Choose your next words wisely. I... I only meant that the instructions to Vault 12 were quite Man. clear. Shut up. Sir, I, I must insist. Shut I up. I access only to one with the key, and you didn't have it. Did he just kill him? I have no Dang. patience for traitors. Now, where were we? I'm not giving you anything. Yeah. Well, what he said. Perhaps your young friend here will be more helpful. Lord have mercy. That thing is huge.
Yeah, yes, I will suggest running. I've never seen so powerful a goblin. He seemed wholly unaffected by my magic. Where are we? <laughs> it can't be. It seems those who set up the pensive, the locket, and the path to both wanted someone with your ability to end up here. Come. We have a sorting ceremony to get to. the sorting ceremony. I'm no expert, but that seems more appropriate. Now, I need to study this locket as soon as I can, but first I must contact the Ministry. They need to know what happened to George and be warned of Ranrock. For the moment, I ask that you keep all that's happened this evening between you and me. Of course, sir. Thank you. Ready for the sorting ceremony? yourself to meet the headmaster. Fig, nice of you to join us. The sorting ceremony is over. There were complications. Complications? It seems the goblin Enough. problem has... Goblins. I've no time for rumors, Fig, and I'm rapidly losing whatever patience I had left. If you're lucky, we might still be able to get you sorted this evening. <clears throat> I'll be in touch. Professor Weasley, we've one more to be sorted. Welcome. You're just in time. Have a seat. Ah, yes. A bit older than the others, aren't you? You come here with preferences and preconceptions. Certain... expectations. I'm looking forward to meeting my professors and learning all I can at Hogwarts. Indeed. 
Hogwarts has much to offer a dedicated student. And what you learn in class will prepare you for challenges outside the classroom as well. Hmm. I wonder... Hmm. I detect something in you. A certain sense of... Hmm. What is it? A desire to learn? I do enjoy a good puzzle, and I believe I have a ready mind. Mmm. You're clever indeed. You have the ability to reflect clearly on that which puzzles others. And you've a ready mind, quick to learn. Perhaps you belong in Ravenclaw. You belong in Ravenclaw! And the crowd goes wild! That's a smart man, Mama! Ooh, I look good in blue. Oh, and one more thing. Due to the unfortunate injury on the pitch in last spring's final, this year's Quidditch season has been cancelled. Enough! It's not as though I've banned flying altogether, but don't tempt me. You are here to focus on your academic futures. I'm sure you will have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. I said, I'm sure you all have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. That is one rude dude. Quite an entrance. It's lovely to meet you. I'm... Professor Weasley, would you be so kind as to show our new student to their common room? I shall see to it, sir. As I was saying, I'm Professor Weasley. Pleased to meet you. Nice to meet you as well, Professor. As Deputy Headmistress, it is my distinct honour to show you to your common room. Right this way. It's quite uncommon for a student to begin as a fifth year. Might be a bit of a challenge, but one I'm sure you're up for. I am, Professor. This is the Ain't entrance no to the Ravenclaw common room. You must solve a riddle to enter. I won't be of much help, I'm afraid. This sort of thing has always confounded me. Who lived longer? The ghost or the poltergeist? A ghost or a poltergeist? Hmm. A non-being can never have been. Look at that. I well am done. him. Now, go on in and get some Y'all can't compete. You have a big day ahead of you tomorrow. What do you mean I shall be back in the morning to collect you for your first class. Thank you, Professor Weasley. You're welcome. I hope you enjoy your first night at Hogwarts. Sleep well. <laughs> I'm sleep like a baby. Alright, guys. That is episode one. Don't forget to like comment, subscribe, hit the bell, all the fancy things in the world, and also check the playlist for more videos ahead of the schedule. Take care.